technical difficulties loading screen. It's gone now. I'm sure it's gone now. Perhaps it was only in my mind. We're back. In, uh... I forget exactly what they call it. Is it just Green Needle Gulch? Is that the only name? Or was there some proper name for their previous compound? We have returned from out of uh, Cassiopeia's mind. We have tamed or appeased the bees. I'm not exactly sure what we've done. Somehow the bees uh, are now on our side. And I hope that we might be able to burn away some of these vines. But let me hydrate myself first because I am ever so flammable. I think I might still be flammable even after that, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Welcome back. Oh, thank you for the subscription. That is so kind. And it is so nice to see you there. Good morning, good morning. Howdy. And indeed, not the bees! I wasn't nearly manic enough. I'll have to work up a little more Nicolas Cage in my day. So buttons. Buttons that do things. Uh, pyrokinesis being one of them. Hmm. Let's interact with it then. Sorry. I jumped right to pyrokinesis. I know that. Mine, but those vines are still too tough to get through. Chew them, Rasputin. I believe in you. You have a young child's tooth. It'll be fine. A fine, young, thick tooth. I believe in you. So apparently burning. Mm, naughty no-no. Do we need some sort of... Cy-buzz-saw? Is that what I'm missing? Can we Cy-blast? Boom! Bing! Ba boom Nope. Completely invulnerable. Alright. Then I guess we need some sort of uh, new ability that I haven't even begun to think of. Trim the vines. They're so thorny, you see, is the problem. They are thorny. And uh, find the root of them. They seem to be psychically... Psy psychically, yes, controlled. Maybe if I trace them back to their source, I can find out who is in charge and convince them to help. Okay, a big greenhouse on a hill. That's probably our clue. Hey, greenhouse, I have beef with you. Green beef, we call it. Exploring, too, out here. Oh, you've been warming yourselves after a outside birthday party. I'm so sorry for the the uh, mid-January outside birthday party. That sounds a little... Mm -hmm. But fun. <laughs> but fun. We already uh, kind of went that way. I think we're, we're probably good. I mean, I've missed handfuls of collectibles. Sure. Rub that in my face, why don't you? But I, I think we're fine. Let's try to find a different path. I'm so greedy. Yeah. Take it. Alright. I don't know if this is the one. Perhaps. It is the most greenhouse-looking. And it does appear quite thorny. Who's chuckling? I hear you. Why are you chuckling? And you, sir, agitated? Can I perhaps suggest a smooth medicated cream? No? Not really my place to suggest. I see. That looks like a little psycho I shall... I Mm, Sean Connery burst in there. A psycho-isolation psycho chamber. chamber doing out here? That's what I was wondering, Raz. Yeah. I was trying to say it without Sean Connery bursting in. You got there ahead of me. Wow. Compton's Menagerie. All the exotic animals. This, this is where the chuckling originates. Kept his menagerie. Oh, hey, you guys are back. This is where Cassiopeia and our dear friend uh, Compton Bool are hanging out after we've cleansed slightly both of their minds. There's, there's still emotional baggage in there. Oh, there's still emotional baggage. So, lovely dam. 
Uh, this beaver wants to show me how he feels about me deep inside. Let's start there. Yes, sir. I'm a madman. Yep. Come to steal your trinkets and treats. I'm sorry about that. That is exactly how I am inside as well. You've pegged me. You've read my book cover accurately. So, I don't want to burn all of their hard work. That doesn't sound cool or nice. Can, can you lift me in this if I bribe you with sweets? Or is this for political prisoners? Mm. Likely for political prisoners. Oh, you have booked a cruise on the Baltic Sea at the end of January. That also sounds a little chilly, but quite gorgeous. Oh, just stunning. The vistas and views. So I'm assuming I can talk to them. I really don't want to start burning stuff, but that's, that's all my mind is leading me to. Much like Compton's grandson, Dogen. I mean, we both went to the same psychic summer camp classes. Burn first, ask questions later. Especially when it comes to squirrels. Burn first. No, Dogen, no! I Climb up there. Probably need to leap down from above to get this card. Uh, lovely water source. Flamingos. All a bathe. What am I looking for? Where's my foothold here? Oh yeah. We're headed the right way. Either we're going to get to the other side and find all those cards, or we're going to sword fight Davy Jones, and I'm perfectly fine with it. I don't mind clambering up the rigging as long as I get to fight Davy Jones. Do you think I go that way? Would you go that way, or would you jump on the leaf and then... Hmm. I'm thinking this way. But the leaf is so prominent, protrudy. Um, what's another P word? Posthumous. Nope, that's not it. Do pardon me, I'm hearing voices, and I'm wondering if they're just in my head. Yeah, they're just in my head. I mean, it, there is Cassiopeia and, and Compton down there, too, but... Nope, I'm imagining things. Uh, yeah, sure. This jump is makeable. Let's tell ourselves that. get any extra oompa pa out of it? No no deep tuba notes? Are you sure? Are you sure I can't get any oompa pa? Just a touch. Perfect. That's all the oompa pa I needed. Thank you. So we can rail our way down there. Mmm, what a rail of a time to tell you lads. A rail of a time or two. <sighs> now I have to finish it, but it's such a shame. About the flapping fish and the girls I've loved. On nights like this with the moon above, a whale of a tale to tell you lads, and I swear that it's all true. Damn it, I'm so sorry. So sorry you had to hear that. <sighs> Alright, beavers, you've... You've lasted as long as... <sighs> I'm just gonna... I'm not going to. I want to tell you now, I'm not going to go through with it. I won't release the... I just want to see if it activates... Now, having threatened you, we're, we're all good, right? Just didn't want there to be some sort of an environmental puzzle that required me to flood your U-turn. That sounded really weird. I'm sorry. Let's talk to them. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Am I invisible? Is it the hey, ring I put on? Get those big vines off Just didn't press it hard enough. Sorry. But plants are Bob Zanotto's area of expertise. Yes, I've Noted. always found them rather thorny. <laughs> I was just going to say that. Oh, mm -hmm. bully! What? Are you suggesting there's something naughty about that word? What? Miss Cassiopeia, how dare you? 
You two have fun catching up. I'm rooting for you. And I'm not saying that just to be sarcastic, despite how much of a... Just a weird jerk I sounded when I said it. I am rooting for you, actually. Hmm. Some ropes can be cut with Psy Blast. I'm glad to know that. <laughs> These ropes? Psy Blast? Yeah. Oh. All right, the chuckling. Right in my ear, Cassie. It's... You're gonna have to... Should we check the psycho-isolation chamber first? If you were a person who was searching around a sort of... Not quite haunted, but haunted swamp area, uh, would you check the psycho-isolation chamber first? There's someone... something? Birds. Eh, I don't want to bother them. That's fine. We'll be back. Leap into the mouth. Shirt sure, safe and fine. Okay. Guard down there. And kind of a dead end. Oh, we go this way. Yeah. I see now. That is quite the thorn. Can I run behind you? As long as I don't tickle your little t Oh, that's a no. All right. Oh, and it recharges. Good. Run past quickly. Okay. Ah. Oh, ah. Shh. <laughs> Finally learned. All right, on to the diving board. But don't commit. You're not wearing your proper trunks yet. Good boy. Good lad. Into the greenhouse. We've made it. Hello, hello. It is so nice to see you guys there. Welcome it's to another adventure. Or whatever it is this is. A catastrophe? But most importantly, a psychic catastrophe. The finest. Kind of jump back down that way. We'll check it after. Knock, knock. Count Olaf, is that you? The goal of his greenhouse is getting... Ah, oh, it doesn't rhyme anymore. Ah, I messed it up. <laughs> Agent Zanato? Bob? Hey, May I call you Robert? You just miss me. Well, Bo? His aim ain't what it used to be. You could give somebody a concussion. A protective yeah, well, it was your choice to come in here uninvited. It's dangerous in here. Lots of uh, broken things. But my heart. Hey, I understand. Can I help you with that? Sent me on a mission to put Ford Crawler. I'm sort of an expert on psychological issues and emotional baggage. Stop it right now! I don't want to hear uh, any expert, of those things I mean. ever again. You hear me? No. They're all lost, dead. But Bob, especially that one. Uh, uh, no! You're lucky I'm wearing a helmet. Otherwise, that's child endangerment. Even so, even with the helmet, I'm wondering. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Secretly, you want what's best for him, too. I know. We can work together on this. See you in a moment. Fine. No worries at all. Good morning to all. Um... Yeah, I should probably... I should probably ask first. Do you think Bob would mind if I took a look inside his mind? Just a little peek. Hmm. That's uh, a very flaccid... No, he would not. So yes, let's go for it. Very gentle. I appreciate that. 
<laughs> turn to face and welcome. I appreciate everything you do. In we go. Another mind just riddled with Figment's purse. What a life we live. I love it. Oh, I love it. Hello? Agent Zanato? It's a gorgeous aquatic zone. Doesn't look, um, very comfortable for sleeping with so many tools strapped to the back of yours. I'm wondering if we could perhaps unburden you somehow. But first, it's Pirate Sorry, Island. Pirate no one comes. Mm, that's the loneliness I see it's welling up inside of you, like so much cottage cheese. Ugh. Sorry, I got a little, little too vivid there. Tell me, Mister, Mister Zanato, how is it that you, in your immortal wisdom and many back tools, sees this child? Who am I to you, sir? Where am I to you, sir? More importantly, uh, I'm a little gardener boy. Hello, I'm here with my trowel and my spout, Spigot. I'm going to help you... to... replenish the earth, I guess. Yeah. Right, there must be something we can grab once we're in the right spot. Ooh! Is this the right spot? Thank you. Thank you, little gardener boy. We've got figments. Ooh, they're multiplying. I remain in control. Otherwise, we'd have a huge problem. Do I just g go island floating? Is that what I'm? What I'm to believe? Just. Ahoy, we're island floating. I don't think my thing is going to last very long, so maybe we're supposed to bounce across these flowers. Let's try that. Mm -hmm. Nope. That goes right in the water. I mean, they're not so much flowers as they are just water. So? Uh, can the little gardener boy cross? Is, the, is there some sort of gardener boy bridge? I did not see. Otherwise, there's a shovel and my greatest fear all around. Nothing else. Maybe I'm supposed to burn these. Yes, that's my answer to everything. <laughs> when in doubt, burn it out. Too boring. I was probably just talking to him. That's why I'm... Agent poking Zanato? and prodding and puzzling. Strange. I haven't even spoken to him. I don't him. usually get visitors here. That Spout, Spigot. That is the tech. I have to guard. Of course. The Zanatos are famous for their... gardens. It's luscious, Bob. What did I'm you plant here? quite comfortable here. Plant. What kind of seeds did you use? Oh, seeds. Yeah, that's right. Pettiness. No seeds. Lost seeds of vindictive behavior. There, I suppose. Can't really remember. Well, let's go find them. I'm uh, not a good swimmer. Are you? No. I sure I am. Oh. Come to the island then, I no, guess. No, I forgot. <laughs> How about you just uh, imbue me? Is that the right word? You imbue me with your green yep. thumb abilities, and then I'll just... I'll blossom these bad babies into something real nice for us. Would that be... agreeable? Time bubble? Projection? Is my projection... drown? Slash... light of flame? Why are all of my thoughts so violent? Why? Why do they have to be this way? Oh. My 
my heart. All right, get out of here. So no, I don't think he's uh, uh, gonna help us here, but that was the encouragement I sorely needed. In what fashion do I cross yonder wolf? I have a question for you. In what fashion? Oh, yonder wolf is quite shy. <laughs> Are you an airplane to the extent that you might carry me aloft to one of these barrels? No? Mm, now we're trying this. Okay, I did give you a little extension, but then... You know, it was much further than I thought. But then... Hmm... I don't know what, um... Uh, <laughs> what I'm supposed to do exactly. Seemed closer to anything else I've tried. There was no way across those flowers, though I'm still curious. And it's like the first thing. I've, I've done nothing on this level. I've solved no puzzle. This is the first thing. Maybe I just, like, take advantage of this door. I keep thinking it's an exit. Is it only an exit? Hmm... That's how they get you. They, your little preconceived. Yeah, I get Wait. it. <sighs> Don't go. Come with me. That was the puzzle. Bob, uh, we'll find you some more tools. Okay. I promise. I, mean, Look, I don't want, mean I'll to tease you. I don't know if we are gonna find more tools. And I'm then I'll come right back. Trying to relate. I promise. It does very much sound like Gur from Invader Zim. I must assume it is. All right, I got a pig. Uh, I can pilot the craft. Interesting. Mr. Starfish, welcome. So squishy. I love this little pirate shanty inspired uh, background music. Alright, we'll start here. Looks like a health potion island. I'll take it. As I am quite weak. Delirious from the scurvy. Tia. Tia shouldn't have to see me like this. Oh, not delirious from the scurvy. No. Wait. Wasn't quite as smooth an entrance as I was hoping. I went wee and everything, and then mm, he just perched, just perched right on the edge. In we go. It's a place. It it has turned into a building. I'm frightened, but we press on. All right. Who lives here? Tia. Man, I love this game. This is so gorgeous. Ah, it's time for my Look recital. at these kitchens. Look at these cabinets. Gorgeous. <laughs> All right. It seems to be inside the fridge. Hmm. When you say it like that, I'm. Not hungry. Strawberries. Everywhere you look. Mr. Moth? Hey! It's nice to see Hold you it here. right there. Why? I wouldn't want you to get hurt. How could well, that little you. thing hurt me? Oh, they always start out little, don't they? And then they grow and grow and cause so much pain. Here, let me just take Children, this you mean? I know. Wait, I know. no, I want that. No, oh, no you're thinking of you like don't. problems. I see, I see. Okay, I'll chase you through the strawberry swamp until I get what's mine. That's how Boy today there. will go. Uh, lend a hand. What do you I mean? have two of them. Which one would you Just, like? Just uh, caught in a bit of a bind here. If you could jiggle me loose, I could get some fresh air on my face. I'll work it out. Just hang in there. 
Was that a joke? Huh. Because uh, I didn't ask for any jokes. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. No, I understand now that it was Did an I inappropriate time. Uh, Swing free, that's my love. The stuff. Yeah, a little motion really gets the juices. Oh, not the juices, no. Anything but oh, the juices. Guess, you know what I mean. Hang on. I'll break that final vine. No, 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 no. Just leave it. I think this is all the freedom I can handle right now. That's fair. Some stability. Does help a growing yam. So I'm assuming I can leap across there, but only during... Mm, during the great yamming. When am I going to grab those figments? They seem quite distant and surrounded by ouchy water. Not something I want to put my child's boots into. Alright, here we go. Mm, the big moment. The big moment of failure. Woo. We did it. Oh. Oh, I'm so impressed with myself. Uh -oh. I can How practically you kiss me. That bird? God, I got this feathered fairy service right where I want him. 20 feet in the air? He's keeping me moving so I don't plant roots. It's a constant struggle. Mm. I, uh, yeah. Hey, I, I can see that. your house from here. So I don't want to go that way. Is that is that foolish? No. Nope. I thought I might have it a second fly. longer. But no, no second for you. Much like Oliver Twist. Get back in line, boy. Not for the gruel, for the work. Silly boy. Alright. Whee! I don't know where I'm landing. Yay! And. Huzzah! Onto the stormy weather dark spirits. We've all been there. We've all been on a bottle of stormy weather. A time or two. So many figments. Real, uh, real deep in the water. All right. I'm starting to think Does anyone have an, that have he an might have a bag? sort of underlying drinking problem, just under the surface. You see, I'll be right back. Hello down there. I hope you're not taking me back to your nest to. Uh Feed something. I mean, that is one of the better alternatives. Name for, why for me he's this monster so roughly back to bearing the nest. me over the sea. <laughs> I like your turn of phrase, sir. For the lift, by the way. All right, let's try this. Yikes! Mm, so many dark spirits. I'm one on more line. time around the block, Jeeves. <laughs> Could go get that figment. You know, and I was scared to try swinging too, but now that shoot I'm doing up it, that way. I love it. Perhaps. I don't know where that will lead. Let's try it. Wait a second. What am I doing up here? <laughs> All right. Cool. I don't see anything else we've missed. <laughs> But that's how you miss it. I don't think my thing will last all that way. I keep wanting to leap to the line, but I should not. Kites. <laughs> Thank you for your quick little feet, Raz. That really helped me out. Look at me! I'm the king of the jungle! Aww. I thought I might have made it. Oh, they had to carry Harry to the ferry. There you go. All right. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. It's all coming together. Hello, duffel bag. Do I have your tag? I do not. Name for me this monster so roughly. Okay, head that way. Get onto the wood. There is a 
like a golden nugget of wisdom or whatever it is over there. I'm not quite sure how to get around. Guessing we might be able to climb on that straw. Have an air sickness bag? I should have just gone for it then, but we'll catch him next time. Start here. One more time around the block, Jeeves. Oh. Mm -hmm. Put me down, wretched demon. <laughs> you wretched demon bird. Okay. Hope you're not taking me Assuming back to we could leap to, uh, to several leap places, somewhere. perhaps to that nugget of wisdom, but you might have to go around the straws there, I'm assuming. So this might only Hi, take me back to the friend? duffel bag. They just love to fly and fly. Will that take me all the way up? It doesn't really seem like it. Probably not makeable. Let's go this way. Man. Hmm. I either need some sort of a levitation upgrade. Or I just need to be braver about this this pole. Let's try it. Hey, I can see your house from yep. here. Is it green? Wonderful job, Raz. Try for this. Oh, oh. Ah. I'll take this nugget. Beautiful. All right. Rank 62. Should we go back on the straws? Yes, probably. Yes, probably. <laughs> like that. Little catch he does. All right, Devil Bag Dag. Show me your innermost yes, secrets. Got the Devil Bag Tag. Hmm. Delicious. All right, that means we have to go back to the Devil Bag now. Great, great. Our speed running time is just no. Duffel bag is more important than any time. Thanks for the lift, by the way. I didn't catch your name. Hello, my sweet. Hey, hey, look at me. I got something for you. Yeah. That yeah, feels better. Hello, hello. Good morning to you as well. Name for me this monster. Welcome so to the madness. Me over the <laughs> as I attempt to lubricate. And speak at the same time. Do Bart. Hey, I can see your house from here. Is it green? Stop <gasps> peeping in my windows. But yes, it's green. <laughs> All right. This would be a great time to, if you wouldn't mind, just auto saving it for me. If you wouldn't mind, I'd love to see that. It's up to you. It's fine. Instantly destructive in a stranger's so home. Yeah, you spend so much time on them. Sometimes the ones that look the most sick are the ones you have to spend the most time on. Is that, is that not how it goes? Oh, hello again, little me. That's not quite what I want, but I'll see you soon. Burn away some of the... How do I say this? Drier shrubberies? That seems to be about it. Alright. Mr. Moth? Careful! Gorgeous. You almost touched it! Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm kind of trying to still, even though I know you warned me, but. It's almost <sighs> like you want to get hurt by this thing. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I... Just natural curiosity, the, the young mind. Come on. Oh, I don't know exactly which way I'm going through the swamp, but that's fine. Ooh, that's just fine. No, it's not. Ah, whatever this is. Perhaps since it's so filled with the Oopsie. devil's seedy liquors, it, I can only touch it once. Most water, you bounce, bounce. Ah, this you bounce. Ah. I mean, you don't even bounce. Oh That's that even. You would don't be. want to be near this thing. <laughs> A miscommunication. All right, we'll have to come back around for that then. Ooh. I'm I warning you. you. In a friendly right. way. 
first tag. There we go. It's, mm, there it is. The devil's liquor. Stay away for His your purse. Own safety. Looking forward to finding you. So I've got a present for you, and we do. All right, moth is going that way. Anything else I can grab? I'm tempted Hideous to just let you get hurt. Hideous ghostly figures reaching out from the brine. What's that sound? I hear that too. It's Ms. Purse. She's purse. I think I hear Perched. some emotional baggage here. There it is, here. atop. Oh, she's so cute. She's always ready for a night on the town. She's my especial lady. Mints. Someone needs a Mr. Clean magic eraser, but we won't go there. We won't. Hmm. Looks like my plant friend is caught up in some regrets. What are you oh, no. talking about? I have no regrets. And these must be somebody else's. Yeah, I mean, that's possible. Yeah, maybe I brought these regrets in. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, Bob. Going to Your regrets are potent. I love that. Just flies away cackling. Ha <laughs> ha, I've learned nothing. Okay. Over here. See where this brings us. Nope. Back the other way. They, they teased me. I'm starting to think you don't so trust my opinion about seeds. And they sure did tease me. Is this boxed wine? Bread it is. From above. <laughs> Bob, um, you were just you were just drinking boxed wine with a crazy straw, weren't you? Hi, have you met my friend? They just love to fly and fly. <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, Raz, you're so limber and impressive. This We're all Bob's clapping. No, trust me. Hello, Bob's mother, Tia Zanotto. She, too, kept tools in her hair. It's nice to know it was a family thing. These leaves, they look gilded in some fashion. No doubt a uh, symbol of a mother's pure hey, love. don't get so and, close. Uh, sweet, sweet times for Bob there. Uh -oh. And she got a little, um... You don't want to be near this thing. A little weary after so much snipping and pruning. Uh, she, she needed a little a lie down, but I'm sure she's fine. Uh, I'm sure that's hey, no Mom. indication of things uh, are to... Are you heading out to the greenhouse again? Things to come? She's running. She's afraid. She's punching. Ah. What are you doing out in the greenhouse for so long? It's none of your business. You out here? Oh, that's a lot of... That's a lot of old greenhouse gin. Mom? Well, that's a little foreboding. Oh, yes. Only very bad things down there. Hello, hello. So nice to see you for a quick Perfect sec. Place for this. A capital Q quick sec. Oh, come on. <laughs> You'd better leave Bob's memories alone. He I will not until I've made him feel better needs. about it. What's so dangerous I don't about care. a bad... I'll fight it. Uh -oh. I've become quite adept. Look, Mr. Mood, I'm sure we can work this out. For instance, a little bit, uh, let's examine the source of... A bit more than a panic attack. Hi, what's your weakness, could I ask? You need to find its source. Alright. Not working. 
Bam. Okay, side blast is no. It's an instant no. No real point in pyrokinesis. Oh, they got me with a triple. They got me with an old triple wet boots. They can't hurt that thing. Clairvoyance, I see. I'll wait till it's doing that again and try to catch it. Oh, it's immune to clairvoyance right now. Become un immune to there clairvoyance. Must be something causing this bad mood around here. Not such a bad mood now, are you? Aww. Nice. All right. Now we know how to fight bad moods. Just requires a little clairvoyance, is all. Must yep. be why I've always struggled with it myself. Headed down the pipe, are we? Ready for a cleaning? Ah! Get our best Dick Van Dyke Cockney accent out for this chimney sweep scene. But I will not step in time. You can't make me. This is a rather more serene section, but it just leads me to wonder if, like this flooded church basement, my tears soon will flow. Mom, it's, it's bedtime. Are you still out here? Are you... Are you in the greenhouse of tears, Mom? S soaked with gin? Are you... Are you still alive, even? Mom? So this must be Lily's great grandmother. Uh oh. Just a bottle of a bottle at a time. What could be the harm? Moths know, right? So sorry. Is that any better? I'm very, very sorry. Thank you for warning me. Silly how it keeps doing that. All right, perfect. Very sorry. Thank you for the warning. Sorry it took me so long to catch on to you. Look familiar? I don't know. Looks big. It's it's a seed. It's Let's not play. hope see what happens. necessarily, but it's close. It's sort of a metaphor for hope. Oh sure, just the game seemingly. I'm so glad it wasn't too terrible. I really appreciate the warnings. I would be lost without you guys there. I never can hear it myself. As an expert gardener, I'm sure you know the value of patience when it comes to Well hello. I'm off to find more seeds. Uh, well, don't you think this is enough? Uh, More's always better. I'll I mean, be it's right progress. There. We'll get there, Bob. We'll get there. Also seen you've, <laughs> you've redeemed mystical musical madness. Is that specifically for step in time? Because <laughs> that's going to be... Oh, I'm going to have to drag that up from the past. Take their dichotomy accent. I shouldn't have mentioned it. <laughs> All right. Was that a new, uh, new pathway to an island? I see. One second. I'll be right back with you, Raz. Mm, I have to refresh my memory from so very, very long ago.
Oh no. Oh no. What have I gotten myself into? I made it all the way down to flap like a birdie, step in time, and now I'm, I'm starting to wonder. Never need a reason, never need a rhyme, flap like a birdie, in time. Up on the railing, step in time, up on the railing, step in time. <laughs> what a weird movie. <laughs> Why? Why? I love it. All right. So what was it that sprouted? Is it these red ones that just became real to me? It must be. All right, let's get back on the door boat and see what happens. Nothing else to grab up there. Good, good. Mm. So, head this way. Ooh, I love this little mini game here. This is kind of unlike anything else you have done in the series. A little piracy in the day. Our figments off the starboard bow. The, the port? Not much of a sailor. This looks to be the place. Fresh pigment shells, etc. Going ashore. All ashore that's going ashore. The figment of a lighthouse. Mm -hmm. Many a ship has crashed upon the rocks after thinking that they've seen the lighthouse, but it turns out, no. I gotta clean this up. That's a safety hazard. I'm assuming I must be able to get around there somehow. But how? so nice to see so many of you here. I am incredibly honored to be leading such an adventurous party. It has been such a long week, like ever since the beginning of the year here, uh, ever since it became January, every day has felt like several, and every week has felt like about six months. I think I need telekinesis here. And I've just missed uh, hanging out with you guys. It feels like it's been forever. So glad to be back in your company. All right, that will take me warping to a new uh, plane of thought. Let me just grab this shell frigment. <laughs> frigment. I've become angry at them. Frig these mints. This figment here. Before we change our uh, perception. Shall you stab January in the soul? Yes, both. Right in the... In the feet. Yeah. We'll watch it crawl around and beg for. But I've gone too far with it. I've just realized. Sorry. <sighs> but yes, please do feel free to stab away in a metaphorical sense. <laughs> Alright, into the bottle with us. Just like dear Bob Zanotto. Oh. Probably being slanderous before we know the whole story, but... I'm so not quite sure how to get that one. And it's so... Mm, so prominent. I don't think I could make it. It's probably worth a little bit of his health to try, but... <sighs> Sorry, Raz. Oh, so very close. Must have to go around somehow. Maybe another boat trip. For now, let's just leap and see into the bottle. Aha! I'm no plant scientist. But that looks pretty seedy to me. It does, doesn't it? Some real seedy behavior. Every time I see a spider web in a game, I assume it's some sort of a secret. I don't know why. That's just a Pavlovian response I, I've conditioned myself to have now. Which makes me think I should do something with it. And, um, 
The only thing I can think, again, because I'm a horrible, violent, terrible person, is lighted flame. But that's just a spider's home. That's just how he feeds his family. That's how they feed their family. And I don't want to take that away from them. This is very piratey. Gotta get out of here. It's Bulb Bob. Hey, you okay over there? What? Lined uh, up me? just right. Oh, I I'm great, thanks. Oh, okay. I like how you never ask for help, Bob. I mean, that's very convenient to those around you, but then, um, see, when you slip underwater and uh, nobody knows how to help because you've done everything yourself, <gasps> your whole life, and I know I'm starting to talk about myself here, Bulb Bob. I know that that's happening, but... I'm just wondering if perhaps there might be another way. If you could admit that you are in, uh, let's call it, a bit of a pickle. And I could unscrew that jar for you. How's that sound? I got you, buddy. Oh, thank you. I feel much better. Ooh, sorry about that. Cabbage burps are the worst. We've all been there. It's fine, Bob. Fantastic. This is very reminiscent of the old uh, Linda sequence. Ah, Nearing well, Fishopolis. Anyway, thank you. Or Lungfishopolis, rather. Speaking of lungfish, come give me a smooch, madam. I feel Please. so much better. I'm desperate and lonely and eager for love, madam. Thank you. So, uh, what brings you to That's our no neck reason. of the swamp anyway? There's no reason to demand kisses from strangers. Don't, don't listen to that. This is where Bulb, I get off. Bob, would you like to? Yeah, this looks cozy. Thanks for the lift. All right. Is there any, uh, I don't mean to be rude, is there any tit in my tat? Are you going to, are you, no? I work on tips, is all I'm saying, I just. You're welcome. What? For saving you from that time bomb. It's just a seed. Ah, but isn't a seed just a bomb in slow motion? Isn't a seed. Just a bomb in slow motion. All right. I didn't expect my day to be derailed like this, but fine. Fine. Yeah, it is. It really... Yeah, I, how dare you mention it? Shattered my reality. What a great area to be in. Game designers? Mm, chef's kiss. Alright, did I get the upgrade for those? I kind of feel like I did last session. Let's test that theory. I can connect. Wonderful. I remember, when I couldn't. <laughs> remember the days? Is that it? Seemingly. Fair enough. Alright. Into the below decks. I believe we might be capsizing. Um, this doesn't look right at all. The below decks, uh... You shouldn't ever comment on someone and say that their below decks doesn't look right at all. That's not... It's not your business. Sometimes we find ourselves in positions where things are coming out of our mouths that we're not entirely comfortable with. You know exactly which positions I mean. No. Censorship. And it's arrived just in time. Oh, I'm, I'm so happy with how this worked out. 
in the commentary. Making it impossible to do any damage. All right, let's get this guy out of play. Hey, come back here, you, you little sneaky pool jumper. Stay no, still. Really. They're under that enabler's protection. I can't do anything until I get rid of that enabler. Yikes. No, I think it's tough. Oh, and a bad mood. Okay. I'm gonna need clairvoyance then. Clairvoyance then. Okay. Let's see what's causing this bad mood. Hello. Tell me your troubles. I will write them in a notebook and tell you uh, of how many different mental exercises you should do to cure yourself. Alright, bad mood resolved. Happy mood now. Lost some health to that censorship, but... Alright, alright, let me at him, let me at him! Where'd they go? Hey, where's the seed? What seed? Oh, that thing. Oh, I dropped it in a river far away. Thank you for trying to protect me. I'll have to go find Wait. it. And I don't like rivers, but hey, okay. It's not in there. Not in there, I said. <laughs> I'm starting to suspect, based on the gentle glow, that it is in fact in there. Okay, one more figment and another one here. Let's grab those real quick. Now that we're not being pool skipped and censored. Seems to be a lot of uh, evidence of parties and various debauchery. Various debauchery. Exhibit A. Was that, uh, organization-wide? <laughs> Are they trying to imply not just Bob Zanotto, or is it contained to his mind? Because this is like a recreation of headquarters. But everyone is drowning in an undisclosed liquid. We might assume... Come on, killer. I'm taking you along for protection. Good idea! Just in case. It's you and me, kid. Let's show them who they're messing with. Over this way? Oh, great. That, that's exactly what I would have done. Is it? I haven't been over here in a while. Oh, this looks spiky. No, 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 no. Hey, everybody. Sorry, I got distracted with how cute you all are and walked right into a thorn. Aw, you're all so cute. Careful, Ouch. stuff here. Hey, you really ought to put down some yellow cones here. I uh, don't suppose you have any golf shoes on you, huh? Something with uh, cleats. If you start slipping, remember to lean into the slip. Oh wait, is that? Or maybe it's away from the slip. Careful. Yeah, I think who knows? one of these tiles is loose. Did I hear a crack? Yikes. Not sure exactly which tiles are loose. Ah. I guess the ones that are cracked. There we go. I can tell oh, visually. I was just doing it by trial and error for a second. Well, would do wonders for this. Step lightly, young ward. Step lightly, young ward. That hike really wore me out. Send me down for a rest, will ya? I mean, sure, but then I am gonna be stuck inside a bubble of liquid death. So, uh, being I hope you have a plan. This really brings up some... <clears throat> it does up bring some up some of that, doesn't it? <laughs> Two memories. Oh, are you headed down to the boss's office? I do not envy you. Fire! Bit of a bit of a hard yam, is he? I help create this place. Dense rutabaga. Recruited by Ford Crawler himself. No pipsqueak nephew's gonna fire me. Hmm. 
I'd hate to see Truman get that mad. Getting quite good at seed collection in my little knapsack. All right, one more, perhaps. Got another one. Who knows how many more? I could do this all day. Oh, this is going great, don't <laughs> you think? It's so cute. I'm off to find more seeds. Now I'm just doing it out of spite, though. The bottle has risen. Follow the yellow brick road. I saw a hat box tag there briefly. I do want to check if you can get off the door, like wherever that lighthouse figment was. Because otherwise I'm not sure how such a thing would be accomplished. Let me just take a quick peek over here. Out on the high seas. Adventure on the high seas. Someone's behind me. Out on the high seas. And I am frightened. <laughs> this is not right. So yeah, unless you have a dock, you cannot... Oh, good. You can angle it just so. But you cannot disembark unless you have a dock. It's the Kraken! Let no joyful voice be heard. Okay. If you insist, Daddy. His purse. Hat box proper. Good to see you. Alright, let's try jumping off here. I guess I already collected some of them on the way in. So maybe there's nothing left for this little island boy to put his grabbers to work with. Here's the steamer trunk. Steamer tag. trunk. All right. Huh. Yeah. Hardly worth the trouble. Hardly worth the sprain. Yoink. Mm. Yeah. Now that was worth the sprain. Oh, so close. What a shame it was that it was not close enough. It's hard to get over there. Especially when you're jumping inappropriately. You've hit the bottom of the bottle. Oh no, sewing emergency. I'm so sorry. Thank you for, for stopping by and good luck. The sewing emergency. I'm so yeah, sorry. Just that sounds like on. no way to start a Saturday. What? What's wrong? I wasn't doing anything. You weren't about to grab that seed. <laughs> grab that what? Be honest with me now. Oh my god. I didn't even see that. Let me grab that. <laughs> no, wait! <laughs> Thanks for the tip. Anytime. Oh, my pleasure. If you're in a rush, it was just Up my pleasure. Junior Burr man. All right, now get a wisdom. Oh, wow, I was not expecting to make that. Thank you, game. That was quite generous. Because my performance, mm, quite poor. It was not at all like working with Meryl Streep. I was very ungenerous in my performance. Huh. The table's set. Try the gray stuff. I hear it's adequate. Mr. Vault, I will spank you. 
Stay still, that I may spank you. That's what you like, Mr. Vault. Tears Greenhouse. Ah, a humble dinner. We, uh, we thought about Bob Zanotto's father, who seems to be no longer with us, as we, in a sort of melancholy fashion, ate our lime wedges and such. Afterwards, young Bob cleaned up the dishes, because he was a good boy. That's, that's a good thing to do. If you're at home now, and your mother is very sad from the death of her husband, uh, try doing the dishes. That is just a good place to start. Still, even as the night, uh, night came in, and it was time for him to rest his poor little child's soul, he could not close his eyes. And he continued to wear his glasses, even to bed. He would look with said glasses out at the greenhouse and wonder if there was something he could have done. Regrettably, his mother soon followed, and he was left all alone in this world, staring at the greenhouse and eating his lime wedges solo. He took a little peek, and inside the greenhouse he found, oh, just so much bootleg gin. So much, he, he couldn't imagine how his mother got it all in there. There was bootleg gin for days. Ooh, it was everywhere. I have, I've, I've already pressed the point pretty far, but y you get it. <sighs> I hope I'm not completely, uh, inaccurately telling the story, but that's what's happening. It's uh, completely inaccurate. All right, so this was just a vault side mission then. Cool. All right, back that way. On to the main progress path. Hey, glad you could come. I love a good wedding, don't you? Mm. Now then, to the <laughs> campaign tower, That's my That's quite good the face. Man. He's like, eh, sure. I don't want to offend. But, uh, we, I mean, we could do anything down, else. Literally, demon. we could go anywhere. One more time around the block, Jeeves. Mm, lovely. And we made it. All right, we'll go that way in a second. Let's check back here. Sounds like the right place to get ambushed by hairless forest bears. And yet, I remain unmolested. Thank you, forest Thanks bears. For the lift, by the way. Appreciate that. Well, I was a little late in the cycle there, but <clears throat> thanks. <clears throat> thanks, Bulb Bob. Rank 65. I should probably be checking if I've unlocked. Ah, I didn't even see that there. Ahem. I should probably be checking if I've unlocked hey. any new abilities in the last. Ten ranks or so. Mm. Sir? I don't want to have to side blast you. Okay. Oh, that would be rude. Next time I'm really going to hide it. Hey, don't get so close. Wait, no, I want that. Hey, come back here. Stop hiding in the delicious maze of layer cake. Wait a minute. I don't know about this place. <laughs> this is gorgeous. So many different flavors. I feel like I've just run through a Baskin Robbins. Oh, this level is doing things to me that I'm not comfortable with. I'm not comfortable appearing on camera when it's doing these things to me. Um. Yep. <laughs> so much yummy cake. Yeah, if you can't see the screen right now, this is gonna sound very strange. I promise it's innocent. I promise if you're audio only. Highly innocent times. I think I need to figure out what's causing it. Yikes. Give me that. 
I just oh, need to focus. If I can find the cause of this bad mood, maybe I can get rid of it. I will find it. Ah, it's here. It's on the table. The table itself is causing this bad mood in you, is it not? I will fix this. Wow. It's fine. Remind me not to invite you to my wedding. <laughs> Sorry. Now I've touched all the cake. I ruined the table. I did a little break dance. I'm sorry. Best man's toast. Off to a great start. <laughs> when someone has to loudly protest, it's innocent, I promise. You know it's bad. Come on. Well, oh, those all win. Oh, just right off the edge. But apparently I'm full anyway. Alright, what's out here? That looks oh so dangerous in so many ways. Alright. Okay, up there. We got a couple more out here. Should be almost done with this layer. Switch briefly back to mental connection. And end of the line. What's that sound? It's the weeping of a suitcase. Suitcase tag. That's I have no I tag. Okay, so how do I get up there? Maybe I was supposed to jump across, though it's not very close. Mm, it's not very close at all. Huh. I don't necessarily want to complete that. If there are figments out here, I can get, though. But how? Let me run over here. I'm just now seeing these tufts of candle smoke. So I came from down below. I don't think I have enough Mary Poppins ability to uh, get across there. Maybe I do from that little diving board, though. Let's check it. It's all coming together. For some reason, this is reminding me of like a Super Mario Galaxy kind of setup. Okay. That's the tiniest, tiniest little uh, help. I'm still not sure if it's going to be enough. I would love it if they just gave me a mental connection across instead. Because also, how am I getting back? There's no way to know. Yeah, that was so short. Ah. So, I don't think <laughs> that's going to work. What are my other options? There's certainly something over there. Maybe I will just find myself catapulted that way later. I really don't know. I don't think I'm supposed to get up over here. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to get onto those oars. Unless there's something bouncy. DJ did not bring his bouncy turntables this time around. Alright, then I'm just going to touch the moth. Having no better plan, we touched them all. Look, I've already given Bob two of those seeds. They're harmless. You... what? You have no idea the harm you've done, do you? I genuinely don't. Time I've just been... Get serious. ...sort of plowing through this. Just doing whatever felt right. So yeah, you, you definitely have a case. I'm running out of places to hide this thing. It's never Ooh, a good sign. This is good. Nobody I actually hear eats that wedding from cake, right? Definitely not after well, it's been I a like subject of conflict. Cake. Nobody wants to eat your conflict Down cake. Here, kid. Get me out of here. I don't want to miss the ceremony. I'll be right over. Hang tight. Alright, this looks like a job for time bubble. Sure we have that equipped. 
not going to need to make any mental connections on the way. But good. Oh! I was very lucky that I actually hit that. I didn't have that little uh, Keanu Reeves step on the sword there. I would have been in big trouble. Thank you, Neo. Alright, where is he hiding? There you are, you silly little bulb. So then we're bringing him this way, but let me just grab these fragments. Fragments, fragments, they're figments. And the sooner you get it right, the sooner we can all just... <sighs> I appreciate you offering to carry me down the aisle. My uh, regular carrier broke a wing when we crashed into the Champagne Tower. Oh, it's my pleasure. I'm fine, though. Didn't feel a thing. Takes a lot to crack this old noggin. Uh, you know what? I don't think I'm ready to go in quite yet. Why don't you just set me down over there, okay? Oh, not ready to go in to the wedding, sure. Oh, uh, yeah, that's good. I was like, I don't want to put you down if you're not off. ready to go in. And I don't want to ruin the ceremony. <laughs> Oh no. See what I mean? His face, his beautiful face. What have you done? It's fine. I'll go fix it. Mm. Oh, you were right. You were finally right. And then. Whoa. Mm. So, I just want to pause here for a minute talk about something very, very important to me that's very close to my heart. Um, it's been on my mind for a while now, and I was just, I, I guess I was just looking for the right visual backdrop to sort of bring this up to you guys. It's a very emotional um, subject. For me, it's a very hard, um, di it's very difficult, should I say, that um, Anyway, I don't want to waste your time. We'll move on. We'll go ahead and move on. Thank you for being there for me in that moment. I, Robert Zanotto, take this man, Helmet Fulbear, the happiest day of my life. Oh, this is so nice. I used to think I loved plants more than people until I met this man. When these feelings appeared in my heart, I thought they were weeds, and I tried to pull them out. But this mighty oak has given me shade, shelter, and something to lean on when I needed it. Just when I thought I was turning to seed, you made me bloom again. I do. What a nice little moment. Beautiful wedding arch. Surely this will provide Good healing. To see you again, Helmet. I hope. I'll make sure this gets back to Bob. I'm back. I brought happy memories. What do you think? Ah! Well, Bob, little you helmet did it. full bear cactus. Yep, I did it. He is so succulent. Why so nervous? I'm just. I'm starting to remember why I got rid of those seeds.
I warned you, and I warned you. But did you listen? No! I did not. I really... I'm sorry. But don't worry. I'm here to protect you. Again. Hey, what are you doing to him? Leave him alone! I'm protecting him. <gasps> protecting him? From what? You're about to find out. Protecting him from the ass woman you're about to receive. Oh no! Uh, hey guys. Here we go. Oh my. What is it that I'm controlling? <laughs> Basically go backwards or forwards, it seems. Strawberry models. There must be a way I can hurt them more. This is very slow going. I'm wondering if I can actually get all the way in and land. I've been hit with bigger tomatoes than that. More strawberry mines. That's fair enough. Well, I never. Tell me if this one's too hot. That hurts. It is. It's too hot for me. How could Please, you? I'm begging of you. I know how to get those strawberries well, if they're never. already to your side, and you can't go in front of them because of a briar patch. Maybe you just go over the briar patch. That does seem to heal me, so I should be doing that, I guess. Yikes. <laughs> it was either the fire or the mines. Much like the job choice for Victorian era orphans. You want to stoke the fire or work the mines, boy? Choose. Loving those little lines. Thank you. Thank you, Dan. You have so hard for me to do my job. How could you? So nice here before you. How could you? Her voice. All right, phase two. Here we go. I'm on my feet now, at least. Hold on, Agent Zanotto. I'll get you out of there. I'm on my lead now at feast. Everybody's sleeping. But I'm sure that's temporary. This isn't doing I need to rescue Bob. Okay. How do I rescue Bob? Telekinesis. You can try it. I don't think I need my little friend. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone who's clairvoyant. I could try burning it. I mean, I could try burning it. That's always an option. What am I doing? I need to see Bob. All right, there's like stuff to throw. I'm <laughs> sorry. It's no good. I should just get Bob and get out of here. Time bubble, not what I want. All right, pyrokinesis does nothing. I knew those seeds were bad. I'm not sure what did do now something. You've gone and put him into Maybe it a was the time again. bubble. Or maybe I just wasn't persistent with my smackings. Alright, so back to clairvoyance. Get me out of here. Hey, I can't deal with that bad mood until I figure out what's behind it. <laughs> I've had enough giant plant flies. Alright, come on. Give me a little peek. 
Give me a peek behind the covers. There you go. Let's see if we can get to the heart of this bad move. You make it so hard for me to do right. my job. Bad mood resolved. Let's take care of some Let's doubts. Just call it a draw and stop for the day. Goodbye, my doubts. Everything was so nice here before you. Such a good idea. All right, back to Bob. I don't think gardening is supposed to hurt this. Much. <laughs> it doesn't need to hurt at all. Right. Need okay. to hurt you. Back I mean. on the boat. Oh, this is more properly phase two. Just keep trying my best. Still feel like I'm missing a way to damage the master. Ouch. Moth is becoming involved. Mixing up a special one for you. Well, I never. You so hard for me to It's not something I asked for. Nobody asked you to mix up a special one for me. Seems like she can take over my mind and prevent me from moving for a second. Would love to get a couple more health islands when I'm back in control. There we go. It's definitely a lot to keep track of. Please don't talk about the size of my tomatoes, sir. This is hardly the time. Why don't you get lost, kid? How can you do this to Bob? You love him. Love? <laughs> I don't really love him. If I did, how could I have left him all alone? Helmet? Helmet would never say that. Right? <sighs> hey, why don't you just... Hey, why don't you just moth off? He was making some progress. Sometimes you have to feel it, even though it hurts horribly. You have to feel it and be present for it. Or else it will never, ever, ever go away. So many tomatoes. It's <laughs> like amateur hour up in there. All those tomatoes. Oh, could you? I love it when she says that. Every time it makes the fight so fancy. I think every boss should stop to say, How could you? Slivers remain. Pretty sure that was also a number from Mary Poppins. We've already done step in time, so hell, we might as well feed the birds. Slivers remain. You guys know it. Cats that won't. Almost. Almost. Go down. Go down. 
and hard and beardy. to get in close and interact. I was taking it sweet time. Um, you've got something on your face, Bob. Doesn't that feel better? so bad at gardening yourself. Thank you. Think you can handle them now? I'm willing to give it a try. <laughs> How about those? Ah. Well, I'll just take them one at a time. That's nice to see. How you feeling, Bob? It says you emptied Bob's bottles. Yep, all the bottles in the blue bin. Bottle caps, too. Hey, that too. We're recycling plastic now. Can you believe it? <laughs> so, uh, Agent Sonato, think you could help me with a little... yard work? I've got an astro lathe wow. I'm just dying mess. to get into. Yeah. I mean, it's impressive as far as strength and mass, but in terms of aesthetics, it's all over the place. You talking about the vines? Or that beard. <laughs> Who's this? <laughs> Helmet. So this is where you ran off to. Figures. What? It's me, Bobby. It's your psyching. But yeah, I got a little explaining oh. to do. He's Elijah Wood Where's now, but body? he's still your helmet. I was lost for a long time, until this one found me. Body's on loan from the mailroom. <laughs> Hang on. Old Borrowed Mick. lips. Wouldn't be right. Oh. And he's not as cute as you either. Well, neither are you. Borrowed right. lips. Come Wouldn't on, be right. let's at least wash that I, beard. That I'm smell? so happy about that. You and I'm sure I Nick is things. too. Just in case. I know. <laughs> Helmet knows Bob personally and is comfortable with all of the things that might be in his beard and quite sharp. But that's. You shouldn't put that sort of danger on Nick. Who knows what you will find inside Nona's mind. Be sure you're ready before activating the astrolabe. Fair enough. We will try to collect the rest of our scavenger hunt items out here before we proceed into the machine. Oh, we're getting close to the big maligulation, <laughs> if that's appropriate to say. Yeah, Let me take a quick look in Otto's thing here, see if we have any newly unlocked for that special upgrades. Projection in your life. We have 34 cards, so I should buy three eyes. Let me do that now. Assuming I have the cores for it. With the shards, whatever. Let's combine those. Huh? Alright. We're almost uh, ready for another one as well. In fact, while I'm here, we can do it any time. Alright, I haven't really been using Psy Pops or Dream Fluffs. At some point, I'm sure I will hit a nasty boss battle in which they become a requirement. But we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. New items. Digitizes your archetype. So you can have the little paper cut out. Or you can have... I don't know exactly what that is. Watch your archetype move like the wind. Just changes him to look faster, perhaps. Muffles your archetype. Never. How dare you. Your archetype explodes into confetti upon death. I love them. I would like to... Upgrade that a little for, like, boss battles where it's necessary, especially now that bad moods have become a thing. It would be nice just to be able to quickly knock them out, but it's not that big a deal. 
drop... Hmm. <laughs> okay, lips. Double the rate of titanium droppage would be great. I'm already, like, probably past the point of needing to uh, afford many things. That's probably silly to say, because I've bought next to nothing. That's nice, too, just to be able to blow sensors away a little quicker. Doubts explode when you use pyrokinesis, which is what I've been using. It certainly helps. Pluck a ground chunk to throw. Objects will daze them longer. More time bubble time. I don't think I need to jump into any of these right away. There's plenty that I can buy once we're trying to get uh, the last few upgrades, say, for an achievement. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. All right, we've ranked up to 69. Yes, I'm sorry. And we are almost ready to jump in the astrolathe. Let me briefly refresh my memory on the outstanding question... Not question. Scavenger hunt items. <laughs> I was reading that. Just as it happened. Where is that kept? There we are. So I'm missing the novelty mug and the enemy surveillance device. We will try to at least find those before we jump into the astrolabe. I don't know if there's any other side quests I haven't started yet that I need to perhaps run back to headquarters and check with some people on. But it kind of seems like we're getting close to the uh, grand finale here, which I love. This game is like the perfect length, too, so far. I'm not sure if there's going to be another twist, but if it's getting close to the end, I've loved how they've set it up. I cannot wait to be back in your company here. I had better end the session for now. But if I can rush back later this afternoon, I will. Otherwise, I'll certainly see you guys tomorrow morning for another weekend stream of my very favorites. Once again, I'm so very grateful for the opportunity to hang out with you guys. It has been a long and lonely start <laughs> to 2022. And everybody, everybody I know, most of whom are in the chat now, <laughs> have had, like, car trouble and, and thefts and smoke detectors going off at all manners of the night. It's just been, like, one thing after another. Complete chaos. And so the one small amount of sanctuary I have here with you guys is hugely important to me. Thank you for watching me play silly games. I will see you again soonish, and I hope that your Saturday treats you well. Bye for now. <laughs> oh, I'm catching up to the chat. Yes, absolutely. Thank you guys for being here. Smooches, much love to you all, and ta.